Hello, my name is Mr Mavs and today we'll be going through a level 2 functional skills question on calculating area. So this is the kind of question you're going to get on a functional skills level 2 exam. It's a lot more complex and one, one thing you'll note will be the formula that you're given to work out the area of a trapezium. So in functional skills level 2, this is when we start having more formulas that would be more familiar, maybe, in a GCSE exam. Let's just go through the question. The pitch is used a lot and will need replacing in the next year. This is like a football pitch. A budget of 500,000 has been allocated to pay for replacing the pitch. The manager has received a quote of £28 per square metre to replace the pitch. Should the manager accept the quote? Justify your answer. What we've got to do first is work out the entire area of the pitch. So the central part of the pitch, as you can see, is 90 metres wide and 180 metres in length. That's quite easy, so it's 180 times 90. And here, as you can see on the right, you're given the formula for calculating the area of a trapezium. So it's A plus B divided by 2 times the height. So you'll have to turn your paper around to see the height. The height's 18 metres. And the A would be the 60 metres. And the B would be the 90 metres. So you add the A and the B together, 60 plus 90. You divide it by 2 and then you times it by its height and you'll get your answer. Now as you can see this is a four mark question so let's just run through the answers and what the examiner will expect to see to get your full four marks. So okay so you're going to get one mark for slotting in the numbers into the formula to work out the area of a trapezium. As you can see 60 plus 90 divided by 2 now those brackets are really important. 60 plus 90 divided by 2 equals 75. If you had 60 plus 90 divided by 2, you'd have 90 divided by 2 is 45, plus 60, you'd have 105. So there are slight differences there. That's why those brackets are very important. So 60 plus 90 divided by 2 equals 75 metres. Then, then you times it by the height of the trapezium. 75 times 18 is 1,350 metres squared. Always remember these squared. And then you times that by 2 because there's a trapezium on both ends of the pitch, as you can see. So 1,350 times 2 is 2,700 metres squared. So that's just going to get you one point. So then... For your second point, you've got to add on the total area of the whole thing. So you're going to add on the two trapeziums, you've done that already, and the pitch size, which is just a straightforward area, 180 metres times 90 metres. And you total them all up. There's your second point. Now your third point is you're going to calculate how much this will cost. Your total of squared metres, which is 18,900 and you're going to times that by 28, which is how much it is per squared metre. So the total will be 529,200. Now, the question is asking you, should the manager accept the quote? Now, he's got a budget of 500,000. So the answer would be no. He shouldn't accept the quote because it, the cost would be over budget. And that's your final point. No, this is over budget. So as you can see, this is all that we need to produce to get the four marks. We need to work out the area of the two trapeziums, then work out the total area of the pitch, which is 18,900 metres squared. Always say squared, write the little two. And then we work out the cost by timesing the total area of the pitch by 28. And then we get the cost in pounds, which is 529,200. And then our answer would be no, this is over budget. You're going to get another point for that. Thank you very much. I've been Mr. Maths and I'll 
see you later. <laughs>